up again and cause the blinds to see. That's why he's able, he's able, I know. Because he gave a pretty day in our life. That we can glorify his holy name. This is a proud moment for me. That I can come to that place. Where our hero of faith, who has preached the place whose name is Peter, it wasn't easy to preach that time. That time there were so many people praising other gods. There were twelve other gods whose statues are still located in this place. But their heads were cut in that time. There was one of them about whom they say that he was placed here. It was written there that they don't know about that God. Unknown God. He was unknown God. That place Paul came. And with great strength he he talked to the people. He said, I have seen your place filled with so many statues. But I want to tell you one thing. One statue that you don't know. Where it's written that we don't know who, who the God is. I know about that God. He is the maker of heaven and earth. And this this place where it's written here. It's the Acts of the Apostles. It's written here, Acts of Apostles. Or Oda Satrava Bab. It's 17th chapter. From verse 22 to 32. It's written in Greek language. But it's saying what we are saying. Then Paul preached with lots of strength. Then Paul preached with lots of strength. To tell you who is that God. Even today, there are many people praising other gods. They praise money. Or kai lok e dunia nu pooj de ne. Or even to this world. Lekin jada es dunia da banaun wala hai. But the maker of this world. Or chaunda hai ke tu si mere wale raju le ao. He wants that you should turn towards him. Paulus ne akhya toba karo te odi var raju le ao. Paul said turn away from your sins and turn to God. Ke es wale asi jannami kalam vachan nu sun raya. So now all we are present here who are listening to the word of God. He wants to tell us. Turn towards God. Jesus came into this world. He gave life for our sins. Even today if somebody comes to him. That he is my savior. His sins are forgiven. And he can have life of eternity. That life which will never end. This world will not give you anything. Jesus is the one who will give you everything. Let's turn back from our sins and come to him. Because he is the one who can give us eternal life. I was the one who was busy in my life. 
I was in the darkness. लेकिन परमेश्वर ने अपना नूर मेरे ते चमकाया. But God shined His light upon me. ते उस तारीख की चु ओने कढ़िया. And He has thrown me out from that darkness. ते नूर ते उजाले भी चला के आया. And He has brought me into light. ते ओ पैगाम जे दिवसीले नल में बचया. That message through which I was saved. ओ मैसेज में दुनिया भी चिचा के सुनाऊँ ना. I I give that message to the world. के लोग तोबा करन ते मसी यीशु ते ईमान ले आऊँ. So that people will turn from sins and come to jesus christ if there is somebody of you who is present here who wants to give their life to jesus in nave saal da nava din bada suna din hai this is a very good day of new year ke kyu na aaj phir navi zindagi da aagaaz bhi kita jaave shouldn't we start our new life from today is lai je kadi koi eho jeya hai If there is somebody here, जिधर अपने पापा तू तो बात करना चाहूँगा, who wants to turn away from sin, तो ऐसी तुअड़े ले ऐसे वाले प्रार्थना करना चाहूँगे। We want to pray for you now, right now. ताज़े तुसी सदा दी जीवन पा सको। So you can have life of eternity. आसमानी बाप, Holy God, ऐसी तुअड़ा शुक्र करने हैं। We are thankful to you. के सारे जीवन विच ए नमः दिन बख्शे आए। That you have given a new day in our life. कि ऐसी ऐस था ते आके। That we come to this place. तुअड़े नानू